The drama between tech titans Elon Musk and Sam Altman has taken a spicy turn. Musk, the brains behind Tesla and SpaceX, recently unveiled his latest creation. Grok, an AI chatbot designed to inject crass humor into text output, setting it up as a direct rival to OpenAI's ChatGPT. However, Altman, CEO of OpenAI and former confidant of Musk, didn't hold back in expressing his disdain for Musk's brainchild. The tension escalated when Altman took to Twitter to deliver a scathing roast, sharing a screenshot of OpenAI's platform that enables users to create customized versions of ChatGPT, cheekily instructing it to respond with cringy boomer humor. The ensuing exchange between Altman and the AI, now named Grok, unfolded as a digital battlefield of wit and rivalry. As the AI drama unfolds, it's clear that the once firm friendship between Musk and Altman has transformed into a public showdown, adding an unexpected layer of spice to the AI landscape. But the plot thickens. It turns out that this showdown isn't just about humor. It's about a clash of ideologies. OpenAI, under Altman's leadership, has recently faced its own share of criticism for implementing censorship on ChatGPT. The decision to restrict certain outputs for ethical reasons has sparked a heated debate on the balance between AI capabilities and responsible use. This move didn't sit well with some, who argue that AI should be free from constraints to truly reflect the principles of open source development. Enter Elon Musk, the disruptor-in-chief. Known for his bold ventures and controversial statements, Musk's foray into AI with Grok seems to be a direct response to what he perceives as the stifling of free speech in the AI realm. With the recent rebranding of Twitter to X, Musk's timing in unveiling Grok just days before OpenAI's Dev Day event adds an extra layer of intrigue. Is Musk attempting to position himself as the champion of unbridled AI expression? This battle between Altman and Musk echoes their history at OpenAI. Founded as a nonprofit with the noble goal of advancing open source research on artificial intelligence. However, according to Walter Isaacson's biography of Musk, the alliance soured when OpenAI, under Altman's leadership, shifted away from its nonprofit roots and entered into a partnership with Microsoft. Musk, who was originally motivated by a vision of democratizing AI, found himself at odds with the evolving direction of the organization. The rivalry takes an even more intriguing turn when we consider Musk's ties to Twitter, now X. As Musk spearheads a project that champions free speech through AI, it raises questions about the role of censorship in shaping the AI landscape. Are we witnessing a battle for the soul of AI, with Musk striving for unfiltered expression and Altman opting for a more controlled ethical approach? It's essential to note that the Dev Day event at OpenAI introduced a significant development, the ability to create customized versions of ChatGPT, a feature exemplified by Altman's cringe-inducing grok. While OpenAI emphasizes responsible AI use, Musk's grok appears to be a rebellion against what he perceives as the restriction of AI's true potential. The clash between these two tech heavyweights isn't just about algorithms and chatbots. It's a clash of visions, ethics, and the very essence of artificial intelligence. As the drama unfolds, one can't help but wonder, will Musk's grok become the voice of unfiltered AI, challenging the status quo set by Altman and OpenAI? Or will Altman's commitment to responsible AI usage prevail, ensuring that artificial intelligence evolves within ethical boundaries? In the rapidly evolving landscape of technology and innovation, the battle between Altman and Musk adds an electrifying narrative to the ongoing story of AI's ascent and the challenges it faces along the way. Only time will tell who emerges victorious in this clash of ideologies within the realm of artificial intelligence. It's at passing these tests. And that's sort of why we think, well, perhaps we should sort of charge a dollar or a pound a year. That's a very tiny amount of money, but it's, it still makes it prohibitively expensive to make a million bots. So, and especially if you need a million payment methods, then you run out of sort of stolen credit cards pretty quickly. So that, that's, that's sort of where we're thinking, like, we might have to sort of just charge some very tiny amount of money, 0.3 cents a day effectively, to deal with the onslaught of AI-powered bots. And, if, and, and that, that is still a growing problem, but it will be, I think, perhaps an insurmountable problem next year. So, and then you have to worry about, well, manipulation of information is making something seem very popular when in fact it is not, because it's getting boosted by all these likes and reposts from AI-powered bots. So that's why I sort of think somewhat inevitably it leads to some small payment in order to 
dramatically increase the cost of a bot. So I frankly, I think probably any social media system that doesn't do that will simply be overrun by bots. But hold on to your neural synapses, because Elon Musk's master plan doesn't stop at unleashing Grok into the digital wild. Musk, the maestro of mind-bending ideas, has a grand vision that involves merging artificial intelligence with the human brain. How? Enter Neuralink, Musk's brainchild, pun intended, aimed at developing brain-machine interface technology. Musk envisions a future where AI, possibly even entities like Grok, could be directly implanted into our brains. Neuralink, founded in 2016, seeks to bridge the gap between the human mind and artificial intelligence. The idea is to create a symbiotic relationship where humans can seamlessly interact with AI, unlocking unprecedented cognitive capabilities. Picture this. Grok, the cheeky AI chatbot, not just responding to your texts, but directly syncing up with your thoughts and neural impulses. It's a concept straight out of science fiction, and Musk is dead serious about turning it into reality. The potential implications are mind-boggling. Musk's Neuralink aims to enhance human cognition, enable instant access to information, and even facilitate communication between individuals with neural implants. While it sounds like something straight from a cyberpunk novel, Musk believes that merging our brains with AI is the key to keeping pace with the rapid advancements in artificial intelligence. Now let's connect the dots. Musk's unveiling of Grok, the humor-infused AI, could be seen as a precursor to a future where such AIs seamlessly integrate into our daily lives through Neuralink. Imagine having a witty and insightful AI companion, not just in your pocket, but embedded in the very fabric of your consciousness. However, the prospect of brain-machine interfaces raises ethical and philosophical questions. How much augmentation is too much? What happens to privacy when our thoughts are connected to a digital network? And of course, the age-old debate, are we playing with fire when we tamper with the inner workings of the human mind? Musk, never one to shy away from controversy, sees Neuralink as a necessary step in ensuring that humans remain relevant in a world increasingly dominated by artificial intelligence. He envisions a future where individuals can choose to enhance their cognitive abilities, giving humanity a fighting chance against the potential superintelligent entities that may emerge. But it's not just about survival. Musk's vision extends to the realms of creativity and exploration. With a neural interface, the boundaries of human imagination could be pushed to new frontiers. Imagine artists creating masterpieces directly from their thoughts, or scientists solving complex problems with the speed of thought. As Musk's Neuralink project progresses, the intersection of AI and human consciousness becomes an increasingly tangible prospect. Grok, once just a playful AI chatbot, could be a pioneer in a new era where our minds and machines converge in ways that were once confined to the realm of science fiction. Whether it's a utopian dream or a dystopian nightmare, Elon Musk is determined to push the boundaries of what's possible in the intricate dance between human minds and artificial intelligence. The future, it seems, is wired with infinite possibilities.